my boxy charm is finally here. This is, I believe, January's box coming in February. And this is only because I put mine in pretty uh, late. But yeah, I believe February's, February's is coming up next. But I got some cool eyeshadow brushes in here. Pretty cool. Five piece. You got your um, shade, crease, detail, smudge brush, and your line brush. Dude, don't mind this. I was messing with it earlier. But I also received this mascara. Um, Tress or tray steak i think that's how you pronounce it never heard of this brand um but yeah it's a uh, cruelty free and vegan and then um at the top of this mascara is an actual like eyelash curler my eyes are huge so obviously this will not work for me because this is literally the size of my finger I don't know if this would work for anybody, to tell you the truth. You would literally have to just do everything individually. But I think that's pretty cool. And it's, it's black. It's a black mascara. It smells like chemicals, but then again, all mascaras smell like chemical. Um, and then I also received... Uh, this lip polish, this conditioning lip polish um, by Seraphine Botanicals, uh, Whimsical Wisteria, Wisteria, or I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, anyway, it's vegan, it has no mineral oil, no parabens, no all the yucky stuff, no gluten, and it comes with avocado. Uh, apricot and jojoba oils with shea and cocoa butters with chamomile and uh, honeysuckle. Love honeysuckle. Um, yeah, and it's hypoallergenic, which is wonderful. This is also like a vegan. I don't know if I said that. Yeah, vegan. Um, GMO free, gluten free, and it is not tested on animals. Which is perfect. I love, I love this. Like I don't even know what this is, but I already love it because it's sounding good to me. <laughs> all right, next we have. All right, and uh, I have this. I think this is an eyeshadow palette. It's really small, smaller than what I was expecting it to be, because the last few palettes from Boxy Charm has been been pretty like uh, large. But anyway, yeah, I never heard of this brand before. Uh, Ace Beauty Scarlet Dust. So let's go ahead and take this out of the box here. Um, as far as the ingredients go, it has, I guess, your basic ingredients for an eyeshadow. It is not cruelty free. And. It, it also does not state if it's vegan or not. So I'm not really sure about this eyeshadow palette. It sounds very cheap. Um, but yeah, let's get into this. Let's open this up. Hmm. Excuse me in the mirror, y'all. <laughs> it is time for bed, obviously. But yeah, so these colors are absolutely beautiful. Let me take this film off. There we go. Look at these colors. You got sunset, crimson, shade, nocturnal, aruba, hibiscus, lotus, Bahamas, Maui, pink moon, aurora, and sangria. I love that sangria color and that nocturnal color. Those will be perfect, perfect uh, transition shades as well as um, outer corner shades, like the darkest shades. Those are really good. I like that color shade in Sunset Rose. 
um i think those would be some really good beginning uh transitional shades um for my skin tone and if you are similar than of my shade then you would definitely love those too i think aurora and uh aruba hibiscus in maui those are the four shimmer shades that's what it's looking like so far everything else is matte I love the way that hibiscus looks, and I just kind of want to just dab my finger in there. Excuse my ashiness, I was washing dishes. But yeah, that's pretty pigmented. But yeah, it's like, feels kind of creamy. So you'll know, you know that these are definitely going to stay. And I'm like rubbing into it to see if it like what it would look like if you were to like try to smudge it out or blend it out but yeah i think this would be a really good shimmer shade moving on we have glow recipe i actually couldn't wait for this so i went ahead and uh actually purchased the mask myself um i probably should have waited honestly because when i tried it i'm gonna be honest like it was not worth the hype. I'm going to be honest. This was really not worth the hype. Um, it feels good on your skin, but it doesn't do much for your skin in the end. Like, if you was to sleep in this mask, um, you would wake up with your skin or your... Uh, it's like a kind of like... I guess like uh, it comes off as it peeling on its own. So you'll have like a whole bunch of white stuff on your face. Just want to let you guys know that now. But other than that, um, the mask is pretty cool. It's just, it's, it really doesn't do much. It smells really good though. It smells absolutely like watermelon and it's natural ingredients. So I, that I do love. Um, yeah. So Radiant. Pill, soft skin is just a dream away. Okay, yeah. It doesn't state exactly what's in this, but from what I read when I bought this um, sleeping mask, it does have natural ingredients in it. Just want to let you guys know. You can't see it in the back, but I did purchase this prior to receiving this in the BoxyCharm. But yeah, that concludes everything that i have received in this lovely boxy charm uh box of mine that concludes my video please hit that like button if you liked this video if you did not please tell me why in the comments um i will get back to you as soon as possible i've just been really busy with school lately i graduate uh this spring so yay but yeah, thank you guys for watching my channel. Please subscribe, help your sister out, and I will see you guys soon.